What up, what it do? It's your boy JDQ with another video on checking your dollar bills for rare serial numbers, fancy uh, serial numbers. Um, on the screen, as always, on these videos, I put up some examples, all right, of what exactly I'm looking for, all right. There's many different errors or fancy serial numbers to look for. And uh, yeah, I put some on the screen for you to kind of like get the idea of what I'm looking for. Now, <clears throat> in this video, uh, aside from me looking through the dollar bills and all that stuff, um, today, um, 26th of January, uh, a very sad day in the sports world. Um, we did lose Kobe Bryant, okay? So I'll be kind of like talking about that on the side um, as I'm narrating what I'm looking for. Um, or what I find on the in the search um, but yeah so uh, I think this is like the first and only find throughout this whole stash we got that floating number one at the very end of that serial number on the right hand side yeah I try to get like a close-up on it get, get it to focus it took a long time to focus but you know that upper right uh, corner serial number you see the floating one after the five before the C um, so you know that's it's an okay find but it was the only find throughout the whole stash but anyways um yeah so to be completely honest uh, as I was telling a few people um, you know I, I was never a, a big fan of Kobe um, you know, I respected the guy. I respected his uh, talent, his ability on the court. Uh, I respected what he brought to the game. You know, I, I always recognize talent and ability no matter what, no matter who. Um, but yeah, uh, I guess early on in his career, um, me personally, I thought, uh, you know, his attitude... Um, I guess on the court and his pride, you know, I think that's what always like pushed me away from being like a, a fan of his, if you will. But um, also the same way I told, you know, a few people uh, early on today when I heard about what happened to him. Um, I also said that throughout the last few years, um, of his career to my understanding he you know he uh, transitioned well into being more humble and you know a lot more gracious and um, thoughtful and disciplined and respectful and you know all the things that I initially didn't see in him uh, I saw them in the last few years that I saw him play and saw him, you know, just in different events, if you will. So, you know, obviously, I respected the guy no matter what. And, uh, yeah, those are my thoughts on, on him. Um, my prayers, as with everybody else, will go to his family in this time of, like, need and this very moment of needing to be strong um, you know we lost a, a great athlete uh, a great person a great father uh, he was a great father to his his kids and you know we're all gonna miss him um, and yeah uh, I really do hope that everyone takes this moment in and just remembers what he brought not only to the game but to all of our lives he did bring joy to everybody and anybody who watched basketball and loved the game so uh, my, my respects to his family and uh much love to him all right this is jdq signing out love you all thanks for the likes thanks for the subs um thank you for the view um good night and as always on this channel, it's always one video a day and nothing gets in the way. Love you all and peace out.